Hi, this is Terrence Wing from Liquid Learn, and the purpose of this video is to break some myths out there about the cost of building an avatar. We're going to do it all for free. That's right, you heard me right. We're going to show you how to build an avatar for free using a couple of tools, at least free to a certain degree. We'll, we'll call it um, uh, the avatar building is free, the screen capture is free, but in order to input it, if you want to do a green screen effect, you're obviously going to need an editing tool to do a green screen effect. So, what I want you to do is take a look at this video clip of a screencast that I did on creating the green screen effect, and then I'll come back after the video clip, and we'll talk about the tools that I used, as well as some of the steps that you can follow. Now, some of the avatar builders that are out there can cost upwards of $10,000, and those of you vendors that are charging $10,000 for this, be warned. Nobody's going to buy your product after they watch this. So this is going to be a great opportunity for you. You'll find that using Second Life creates an exceptional avatar, even better in my opinion than that avatar builder that costs you $10,000. I think you have more options with the, with the Second Life avatar. You can go to different backgrounds. You can wear different clothing. There are tons of gestures and movements that you can create yourself if you know how to write uh, in, in Second Life, right? Sim, sim language or whatever it's called in Second Life. Um, or you can purchase a lot of these, these movements as well or gestures as well. So this is a great opportunity to save a pretty penny. So take a look at this video and then I'll come back and show you how I did it. Hi, this is Terrence Wing from Liquid Learn, or at least this is my avatar, which is Jit Pitch Inventor in Second Life. And the purpose of this is, or the screencast, is to demonstrate how you can make an avatar for free and a pretty good avatar too. So we'll show you a few of the animation features that you get here. I can clap and I can applaud you for watching uh, this um, uh, screencast. I can do things like count one, two. I can uh, do some other things, which I really don't know what this one is, but they call it extinguish. Um, here's one of my favorite ones. I can pose for you. Yeah, check out these guns. These are some guns. Now, there's a lot of avatar programs out there that you pay a lot of money, some words upwards of $10,000, which, you know, uh, hey, if you have $10,000, great, go for it. But if you're anything like me, then you don't have $10,000 to spend on an avatar program. I'd rather spend my $10,000 on something else, especially since I could do the avatar for free. So this avatar could be used to give feedback to a, uh, a learner uh, in your e-learning course. Let's say they got the question right. I could do something like this. Yeah. All right. You got the right answer. Perfect. And these are some basic. I didn't pay for any of these animations, but of course there are opportunities to buy some more advanced uh, animations. But you know, there's plenty. That's not a great one because you see, I'm I'm kind of falling behind my green screen uh, that I that I created. Um, but I have about eight loaded in here, so you get some different ones that you can look at. It's not the perfect program because you saw as I moved, I just uh, brought my speech. Um, screen or speech stream uh, into the uh, into the picture we want to avoid that happening but that gives us still plenty of options here's my laugh uh, I guess my laugh doesn't want to cooperate here there we go ha 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 again lesson learned make sure you pull your avatar forward a little bit when you're doing this screencast all right so that's a, a demonstration of some of the tools that I can use and you're saying well cool I guess but now I want to know how to do this right you know well I'm gonna give away my secrets because I think you can really get a great uh, product here without spending one penny on this well you'll see somewhere down the line I do use uh, Vegas which you can get a copy of Vegas probably for about you know a couple hundred dollars for the home version uh, which is definitely better than ten thousand dollars so let's take a look at how I actually accomplish this effect All right so you watched the video what do you think I think it was pretty cool when I thought of the idea, I said, I've got to share this because this is really 
First, it'll get some people who don't have the opportunity to spend money on avatars. It gives them the opportunity to actually use this great tool for learning. And secondly, it creates a more manageable budget for an e-learning course. And the more, e the more quality e-learning courses out there, the better for our employees. So let me first talk about the tools that I used in order to create this effect. Obvious, the obvious first tool is Second Life. Now, Second Life is free. You just go to www.secondlife.com and you open up an account there. Play around with it a little bit. Don't expect to just jump in all of a sudden and create avatars. It may take a little bit of learning, but what software program doesn't? And once again, if I can remind you, it's free. So, after you learn Second Life, the second tool I used was Screener, uh, and that's at uh, www.screener, S-C-R-E-E-N-R.com, and that's a product by Articulate, but you can use any screencasting tool. TechSmith has Jing, as well as Camtasia makes an excellent choice, too. The reason I use Screener in this particular case was because, well, it's free. So there's two items that for free and the purpose of this was really to get your budget under control. I wanted to show you that it can be done. And the other tools that I mentioned will cost a, a money. Now Camtasia is not very expensive, but expensive is all relative too. So that's the second tool. And the third tool that I used was Sony Vegas. Now Vegas I believe, and you'll have to do your own research on this, but Vegas has a home edition and I believe the home edition costs probably about two hundred dollars the professional edition I think is around four hundred um, I have the professional edition but for the effect that you created here you, you might want to just use the home edition if you have a video editing tool that can separate a green screen background then you don't even need Vegas um, some some of the free tools out there can do that Microsoft Movie Maker won't allow you to separate the backgrounds to the best of my knowledge um, but perhaps there are some other tools out there and please if you know of them share in the comment section uh, wherever this video is posted on where some people can find a inexpensive tool to do the editing and last but not least I do a lot of my authoring in articulate and I use that as the e-course design or authoring tool that I imported the video into and I simply imported a video over a uh, a picture which was a JPEG or a PowerPoint slide which I converted to a PNG file as the background for the the image that you saw on the last video that's it those are the only tools that I used um, you know besides like I said PowerPoint and you know some people may choose to use some uh, Photoshop tools things like that if they're working with with images and they want to spice up the image but not necessary in this case it depends on how elaborate you want to get so that's the tools the next thing is the steps okay there's the first step is to basically create your avatar so once you get familiar with Second Life then go and find the right clothing that you want to wear and you can shop in Second Life and find places where you don't have to create this clothing yourself and they use a currency, Second Life uses a currency called Linden's and basically it has its own economy and it follows the dollar so a certain amount of Linden's equals a certain amount of dollars and you have to convert your dollars to Linden's when you're spending in Second Life and you can go to any clothing store and pick out clothing of your choice anything from PVC to business suits you name it you can get it in Second Life I even ran across when Avatar the movie came out I ran across a couple of people that were using uh, uh, Naboo's as their avatars too so you can get really really creative with this that you can't get creative with the uh, I almost said it I'm not going to give up that name but you'll know it by the price tag you know that ten thousand dollar software program so the second step is that you have to go to create the second step is that you're going to create a green screen in Second Life now some simple basic building skills will help you with this so don't fret or you can find something with a green background or an odd colored background that doesn't match the background of your avatar and you can work with that in Sony Vegas or whatever editing tool that you're using Next, you're going to capture the screen with Screener. 
uh, or Camtasia or Jing, any of those tools that you, you want to use. Uh, the only one that I mentioned that cost money was Camtasia, um, but that's, I want to say it's about $100, uh, but I'm not 100% sure on that. In your editing tools, the next step, you want to edit out the green effect and place in your background. So place in those JPEGs that you, you saw uh, me use. I use a JPEG from a PowerPoint slide that I created into a JPEG, and I use Jing to actually create that JPEG. Oh, it was actually a PNG, but close enough. And um, once you put that behind the, the green screen effect, you can remove the green screen. So each of those editing tools that you use are going to have their own tutorials to help you do that. So I won't get into detail on that here. Uh, then I inserted the video into the Articulate presentation or onto the PowerPoint slide and into the Articulate presentation. And finally, I published my e-course. That's it. Those five or six steps was all it took to create the free avatar from Second Life. That's it. It's that simple.